Changes may be coming to Greenville's Convention Center. This as the city looks at maybe building a new space for conferences. Renee Wonderlich spoke with both the city and county tonight. Now nothing's decided yet, but the building behind me, it could have a new owner. Police training, Comic-Con, dog shows. The Greenville Convention Center hosts all kinds of events. And over the last year, it was where you could go to get tested for and vaccinated against COVID-19. But now the city of Greenville is looking at possibly selling the convention center. The city recognizes the value of the convention center, but also recognizes that operating at a loss as it does, we need partners to help us. Greenville County Council recently voted against giving the city $400,000 for the convention center. Certainly thankful that the county and the city are, are having conversations uh, and that it's you know, people are becoming more aware of what the situation is, um, but I'm concerned uh, that through our most recent budget process that we weren't able to support the city with some short term funding while we were thinking about ways to be a, a part of a longer term solution. In a statement from Greenville County, spokesperson Bob Mahalik writes, we continue to explore options that could be mutually beneficial to the city county and our citizens and guests. Here between River and Academy Streets, the city of Greenville is in the early steps of possibly developing a new conference center. But if they're already looking to sell the convention center, why build a new space? Not only is the convention center significantly larger, it is more equipped to host large banquets, to host conferences and things that bring in a lot of stuff like an RV show, a boat show, a car show, whereas the conference center would again be more business and economic development driven with a little bit of the, you know, arts, culture, um, entertainment piece in it. So we're looking at different audiences. There's no design yet for the new conference center. After public input, city council will vote on the 23rd if they want to move forward to make more development plans. Now there's going to be two public input meetings on August 16th to see what folks think about the possibility of a future conference center. The first one will be at 11 a.m. The second one will be at 6 p.m. And they're both going to be at the Greenville Water Building. In Greenville, Renee Wonderlich, WYFF News 4.